Alright, they're starting our red. That means Jarvan. Jarvan's gonna be pretty late if he goes for a top lane gank. He's gonna get red into his blue, probably. Which means we should be able to get a call recall pretty easily. Oh, that's really good. There's no way you win that, buddy. He completely missed his W. I can't believe that's even close. It's because I went D shield. You know what, dude? I'm just going to get a call TP back right away. Smacked by the W. Your cries will give voice to chaos. Oh. Wow, I can't believe that didn't get worse. Not bad, dude. Surviving that gank is really big. Since we're getting to play bot side. It's another reason why I went D shield, honestly, because Jarvins usually tend to tend to gank a lot. Cool, let's get a pickaxe here. This will give me pretty decent kill pressure. As far as the set lane goes. How do you stop your champion from moving instantly to CS like that? Um, I use H, but I think the default is S. But uh, you can change the hockey to whatever you want. I have an H for like hold. Hold position, I think the command is, or the key bind. Wow. Dude. Well played. Dude is on 2.5k gold at 6 minutes, dude. That guy's about to take over the game. An 
enemy has been slain. An ally has been slain. This guy's still level 5. Hopefully he doesn't get 6 here. An ally has been slain. I can save ulti, I'm pretty sure. Alright, if you want to get thrown into the grindy. Be my guest. Nice, that's a good round time. We don't lose anything. It's on that GC cannon wave. That was an ocean drag. Yeah, D shield call feels really good into set, dude. It's like the only way I can play this matchup. I've been experimenting with D blade. I just can't do it into set. If I take one bad trade, I just have no sustain. It's hard to test though, because like who knows if the sets that I've been against have been a lot better. And like jungle pressure and whatnot. Mm, I save flash here. If I flash the EQ, Jarvan just ults me and then I'm trapped. It's fine. He is getting a decent amount of jungle help for sure. <laughs> Demacia! Ah! Just dies right after. Jarvan voice lines are great, man. Jarvan and Garen, dude, they're always just like yelling stuff. Even if they die. Ah, she wants to Herald mid. I think mid is fed enough. I think we should have gone for a Herald top here. It's fine, I guess. An enemy has been slain. Has been slain. Never heard Ergot in the German language. I haven't either. I haven't heard Ergot in any other languages, actually. Dude, we can easily kill this. so hard to dive a set. Slain. An ally has been slain. 
Jeez, man, that's tough. That is way too risky in hindsight. You know what's crazy too? I don't even think the set played it like that well. Like he played it okay. Oh, that sucks. I was not expecting a Triss there. If I land E, that's maybe a kill. I don't know though. It would have been close. If she has ulti and like heal, then she probably would have killed me. I feel like pulling Trist out of the fight should be really good for my team. She's their fed one right now. An ally has been slain. Honestly, dude, if she wants to back, I'll let her. It's a pretty bad time to back right before the plates. Dude, I don't even care what happens right now. I'm getting so fed off this. Solo played, solo farm, we cashed in call. This is better than getting any kills. This Jarvan's literally in our base, though. What's going on here? How's this guy, like, 1v4ing in our base? Interesting. Well, Zed is extremely fed. Try to play off this guy. Come on, burn! Ooh, right before the shield, nice. Yo, Bran. Guys. Oh my god, dude. Thank god I got in the bush. I got Titanic, guys. I'm just gonna go this way. I can't believe I lived on that play. 
I can't believe my team was just like watching the set run me down. They must have been tunneled on someone. Alright, sweet. I feel like Brand should get anti-heal this game. I don't really want to use the item slot. Brand's gonna be putting like burn on he's gonna be putting burn on their front line for sure. I think I'll probably get it soon, hopefully. Whoa. This is wild. Gore drinker. Are they gonna surrender off that? We can drop Shelly actually. We're good, we're good. Maybe I should have saved Shelly, actually. I'm not sure. Probably could have got it without using it. And then just use a bot right here, maybe. Five seconds, guys. I waited a little bit. Alright, good enough. Let's go deal with this echo. Yo, gifted hands. Thank you for the sub, dude. 11 months coming up on the year. Appreciate it, man. We can probably just rush Baron. Rush Baron into five man top. Yeah, we got a brand. We can for sure rush. I don't even know if we... Yeah, we probably don't even need to go top. We can just go mid. Legendary. We're fed enough to just fight him here. Kinda need Zed though. Hmm, <laughs> I misclicked Gore Drinker, dude. Dang it. 
whatever. They should be able to end. I don't know why they're going top and like killing the set. You you only need to do this in like a really close game if you're playing it safe. If you're really far ahead and you have double inib, you can just go mid. Like these guys are not strong enough to uh to fight us. Even under their turrets. GG though. First win today, dude. Three hours later. That is our first win today. I think we played that lane pretty well. I'm happy with it. Zed was a beast. For him getting a decent amount of like jungle ganks too, I wasn't really getting too much in that lane. We had the dive, which was like really scuffed. But I'm pretty sure that's the only gank I got. I guess leeching into Gwen isn't that bad. Don't really like to level 1 this champ. Hopefully she's not chilling in here. Okay, nice. Only those who survive this city deserve it. We'll see how rough the armor ruin is here. Hopefully it's not too bad. So my jungle's path and bot, his jungle's path and top. Which means we're just gonna go for the push here, honestly. I'm glad she's playing the lane like really, really passive. Gives me a free cheater. Alright, we'll do Cole into anti-heal. Anti-heal's gonna be insanely crucial this game. My god, dude. I might get an early uh, chain sword. The amount of healing on their comp is insane, dude. I think it's worth rushing this lane too, most of the time. Yeah, this is why we take the back there. He can just gank me right after crab. Nice. He's good to push that in, I'm pretty sure. Let's just go back top. Our wave is stacking. I'm not sure, did the Viego flash there too? I think they might have both flashed. Maybe he just W'd away. Oh, that would have been so clutch if TF lived. Can't see the minion HPs. I hate when they stack up like that. <laughs> Yumi's a parasite, pretty much. It's pretty much the idea of that champ. I feel like Yumi's gonna be a good champ for just such a long time. They would have to really, really get that champion for it to be bad.
Like, whoever you attach to is just, like, guaranteed to play good in team fights. That's just such a good champ. And you can't do anything besides kill the person, right? Unless she, like, jumps out stupidly. Alright, cool. Uh, let's see, dude. I might go... Nah, we'll go Ruby. We'll do this plus Ruby. I was thinking about going at a tie map. And just kind of ignoring the lane. But this lane's not feeling too bad, so we'll just do this. Yeah, Gwen is playing safe. I'm really glad, because she has, like, Ignite. And my jungle hasn't really been playing around topside, so it's kind of risky to go for plays. Probably has Leeching Lear on that back. I am the very definition yeah. Of a and a Dark Seal. I don't know. Oh, there he is. really wish I had a flash, dang it. I even had a ward, but it doesn't really doesn't really do anything. I think he's stealth then too, because I actually didn't even see him. Even if I did see him though, I don't think that ward really does too much. Alright, I'm playing a little aggressive there. Why did this guy rush? Oh, he turned into me. Okay. <laughs> that actually got me. It's like, why did he rush anti heal? There's no way. I see, though. I saw the rest of the items. I was like, wait a minute. Those are my items. I'm finding it hard to play aggressive in this lane, which I guess is fine. Like, we're just scaling. But uh, their jungle's been hovering pretty hard. I think he's going to hover me again. Yeah, look how she's playing all of a sudden. I see... Eh, nah, we don't fight that, yeah. It's gonna be a TV3. I know, I know.
My wave's not in a good spot. It's a problem right now. But I also can't. Uh, I can't push it in until I see. Okay. TP back, no big deal. If that was level 9, I think that would have been a kill. Well, hey, at least we didn't die. That's the important part. Dude is squishy. Thanos there got skinned. And actually the default skin does look like it, huh? I've been liking the default skin, man. I like all of her god skins, but I've been I've been liking the default a lot. Good game for what's in. Mm. Be nice against Gwen. They're kind of heavy AD, though. I think it's okay here. There's a lot of stuff I need, though. A lot of other stuff I need first. She definitely wants to fight me. I can bait this. Oh, yeah. Nice. Well played, dude. 14 minute Titanic with anti heal and call. That's actually really good. We should perma win 1v1s now, for sure. He got he's got the uh, spell book too. One is running for sure. Maybe I feel like she is. Wow, she's not. She must have been waiting for Rift. Dude, that's actually so annoying. They made Rift uh, stack up when you take damage now. So my Titanic just uh, fully stacked a Rift right there. That's definitely something to look for like before you go in. They did that quite a few patches ago. I guess it's not like super new. Pretty sure I win 1v1. Guaranteed I win, actually. I'll spare her from the grinder this time. I'm feeling nice right now.
Yeah, Gwen's W is super annoying. If you're outside the W, you can't pull her. Um, also, if you try to like shoot your ulti at her, it just goes straight through her if you're outside. So you, you really got to play around her W. Super key in this matchup. Can be really hard. It's so nice being able to like see everything going on with the TF port, dude. That ability is so, so good. Like not obviously for the port, but also just seeing everyone on the map, you know? Like the same thing when I was playing really passive right here when they got Herald. I would have kept playing passive if it, passive if it wasn't for that TF ulti. Uh, let's go ahead and upgrade this, probably. I wish that was Kindle, though. Whatever, we'll do this for now. But uh, right here when I was playing passive after they got the Herald, TF ulted and I could see the VAO going for a bot side play, but I don't know if he was, like, hovering around here, or I wouldn't have known if he was still hovering around here. Like, I would have thought that. I would have thought he was hovering for sure. Because most of the time when jungles get that herald, they just like hover top until they can kill you. It's really nice having that ability to play off of. Oh, that ward just died. I was just going to look for a port too. Oh my god, dude. That could have been a 1v3. Oh, and I get the cannon. So much gold. Give me the loot, dude. I had three levels on that Viego, so I was like, yeah, if I just E-flash this guy, he's a goner. Just too much of a level difference. Do we want to get this? Can we get this? Their champions aren't super good at farming supers. I think it's fine to get it right now. Just pressure like Baron Drag, Herald, everything. Oh, we gotta do this quick, actually. Hey, welcome, Sully. It's gonna despawn soon. Alright, three melee. It's so nice, they're all stacking Merc Treads. Mm, let's just go Gore, dude. Oh, if you got that card off. Yeah, we might get a Shelly dance here. 
Oh, dude. No Shelly dance. Wait, maybe? No, it's gonna boot me out. Yeah, it's not even doing the charge anyway. GG. Yeah, Gor I, I would have gone Gore Drinker if that game kept going for sure. Um, honestly, dude, everyone played well. I like the TF. I think that TP play was huge on TF early. Like, after that, he just started helping me out. I think that was the reason he was helping me out so much, is because we gave him that one port. The power of teamwork, dude. Freed by Jade. 